What's up guys, Kevin here. In this video, I wanna to talk to you guys about a topic that has some negative stigma around it, and that is park boards with magnet traction. If you guys have been watching the channel, you know that my last two park boards have been the Headspace and the Space Case, both with magnet traction. And honestly, even for myself, I had a bit of like negative stigma and a bit of hesitation taking that full magnet traction type board into the park. But my experience has been that magnet traction really helps you with any type of ice in the terrain park. So out here today at Keystone, been riding lots of icy tubes, icy rails, and the magnet traction helps so much keep an edge and really to help you properly set up for a feature. And then on the flip side, once you're onto a tube or you're sliding something where the fear of that magnet traction catching comes in, it actually does not affect the slide at all. I found that I slide very smooth. Any fear of catching just totally goes out the window once you slide it once. So in my opinion guys, from riding some park boards with magnet traction, you get a lot of benefit of holding an edge on ice, especially for approaching icy rail or tube features and then you don't get any of that catch once you're onto a feature whether it's a box or a tube or rail it definitely slides very smooth there's actually varying degrees of magnet traction so on the park boards the magnet traction is much more mellow but then if you get into some of the all mountain boards like for example the orca the magnet traction is going to be much more severe because you're really taking it all mountain through some really big icy slopes. So they mellow out the magnet traction on the park boards and you really only get the benefits without any of that negative stigma. And if you guys aren't completely sold on the magnet traction, there's definitely other companies that do the multiple contact points. For example, Arbor has got Grip Tech giving you a couple extra contact points near your bindings. And there's other board companies out there that have got their own version on it but the most exaggerated, and for me, I think the one that works the most is the Mervin boards with the full magnet traction. But just wanted to share that with you guys. If you have your opinion on it, it'd be great to hear it down in the comments. I'll also put a link to my GNU Headspace down in the description if you want to check it out. We're going to keep riding here at Keystone. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video soon.